the initiative of the Global South Think Tank uh, exchange event to build a better, you know, a prosperous world for shared future is a welcome development. I think the time is right to build, uh, you know, to put more cooperation, greater cooperation among the countries of the Global South to promote peace, security, and development, and to advance modernization. Uh, if you look back in 1945, when the United Nations was formed, the world leaders came after the, you know, they came together after the Second World War to make commitments to end hunger, to end violence, to end conflicts, and to promote equality among countries, among nations of the world. But today, 79 years after the formation of the United Nations, poverty is rising, the conflict is escalating, violence everywhere, inequality and marginalization, especially among the peoples of the global south. For example, the war between Ukraine and Russia, the war between the Israel, the Lebanon, you know, the Hezbollah in the Lebanon, and the Hamas in Palestine, and also there are, you know, in other regions of the world, tensions are rising particularly among, you know, between the North and South Korea. And every day people are, you know, having that kind of, you know, fear the people don't that the war in Middle East will escalate. So I think this time that the Global South is coming together to build greater cooperation, it is important so that they will be able to work together through research, they will be able to have mutual learning, share experience together, and dialogue together. I think that you know, the, 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 the future is promising because China is taking the lead in this regard by bringing all the nations of the world, uh, the, the global south together to be able to forge a common front. I think this is the time that the scholars and experts in the global south think tanks is to come together to work, you know, to, you know, to work together to build common front and have greater cooperation so that We'll be able to advance modernization. We'll be able to alleviate poverty. We'll be able to bridge the gap that exists between the rich and the poor. To be able to, you know, promote human rights. To be able to promote and foster, you know, peace, you know, uh, security and development in the world. I think this is the time to, to do it. Thank you.